one of the things that so many cellists fear is falling off the fingerboard, but it's such an easy problem to fix. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, here's what I mean by falling off the fingerboard. <laughs> But the reason this is so easy to fix is because so many people aren't really thinking about the body mechanics that we're dealing with here. So when our hand is in position and we go to shift down or up the fingerboard, uh, look what happens. Your hand is naturally going to pull away. Now the fingerboard starts on the left side of your body and it goes in more towards the center. So it's coming this way, whereas your forearm is going this way. Now. To compensate for this, you have to get your shoulder involved. So your shoulder is going to pivot in, not up, but in, while your hand moves down the fingerboard. So instead of this, you get this. And that's how you can shift and not fall off the fingerboard.